today we're gonna see how Tesla Cybertruck is made in this giant factory. Let's go. The rotation speed is holding steady at three RPMs. Confirmed. The gauge and width are within tolerance as well. Each steel coil produces enough material for 12 complete Cybertruck bodies. Engaging grippers. Clear for lift. Steady. No rotation. Stop. Hold position now. Automated guided vehicle transports laser cut stainless steel panels for the Cybertruck, following magnetic strips across the factory floor. on the stops? Yes, the laser line is perfect. Stepping back now. This 30X steel is three times harder than regular automotive sheet metal. The robotic arm extracts the 120-kilogram single-piece aluminum casting from the Giga Press, lifting it vertically. This single Giga casting replaces 80 individual stamped parts and 120 welding operations. Current flow steady at 18,000 amps. 0.4 seconds per weld, right on target. The thermal signature looks good. Laser welding creates invisible exterior seams that maintain the Cybertruck's seamless origami aesthetic. on the A-pillar right here. Looks good, 0.75 millimeters. I'm logging in now. Every body shell gets inspected at seven stations before moving to final assembly.
panel gaps must be within half a millimeter across the entire vehicle. Each cell produces five times the energy of our previous generation batteries. The orange robotic arm lifts the completed battery module, containing 112 cells. Torque sequence complete on module 6. Confirmed. Moving to position 7. The cooling system maintains optimal temperature across 1,344 cells independently. All connections verified. Thermal imaging shows no hotspots. Pack commissioning complete. Ready for the marriage station. The rear Giga casting provides mounting for our dual motor setup, producing 570 horsepower combined. A little more rotation, hold it there. Okay, that's seated. Ready for the robots. A technician in navy blue Tesla coveralls, securing connectors with quarter turn locking collars that create weatherproof seal. This is the marriage point where the exoskeleton meets the powertrain. We have green across the board, X at plus 0.2, Y at minus 0.1. Copy that. Rotational alignment confirmed. Connector engaged and latched. BMS check complete. All systems green. Bolt check complete. 180 newton meters confirmed. Verify on the checklist. This advanced eight-way coolant valve will manage independent thermal zones for the battery pack, front motor, dual rear motors, and cabin climate control. The OctoValve manages thermal zones for battery, motors, and cabin independently. Coolant pressure is stable at 1.2 bar. BMS shows all cells balanced. Make sure the harness is secured before the dashboard drops. Got it, aligning now. Okay, lift on your side. Make sure the orange loom clears the edge. Got it. The connector for the display is secure. The minimalist dashboard reduces parts count by 60% compared to traditional vehicles. The yoke design gives unobstructed view of the digital instrument cluster.
aligning the front brackets now. Clear on this side. Push it down firmly until it locks. Green light confirmed. Every button, scree, and sensor tested before it leaves this station. As the final protective film is removed, the revolutionary unpainted aesthetic is revealed, showcasing the consistent quality and corrosion resistance of the stainless steel body. Every panel gap must be within half a millimeter across the entire vehicle. Surface looks clean up here. How about the door alignment, Mark? It's within tolerance. A fleet of Finnish Cybertrucks drive slowly off the final assembly line. Bring it back 10 more centimeters. Clear film protects high contact areas during the first months of ownership. Inventory is up to 4 Tour 12, mostly in welding. As you can see on the battery management screen, it's at 100%. And this controls the adaptive air suspension? That's right, giving you excellent ground clearance. 